What's going on, tubers? Well, I'm back. And it's that time of the year again where you gotta fix all that crap. I did that plow over there already, which is good. And this is the paint that I found that uh, matches pretty close to Fisher Yellow because these are both Fisher plows. Um, that one's on Minute Mount 2. So it's a little newer, a little different style with the hookup for the pin and uh, the gussets and stuff like that compared to this old Minute Mount 1. But uh, I was going to sell this, but I'm going to keep it because this pump alone is worth the value of the plow sitting it because it's an Insta Act pump and it's the three plug setup. There's two plugs plugged into one and then there's the power cord right there. And then also this plow, which is uh, newer, but it's an older Minute Mount 2. Um, I've had it for a few years now and I had my buddy actually extend the frame because this is the original hole for the mount for the old style lights which was on that plow and I ended up putting these new lights on which they're alright but you could find aftermarket lights to replace that. So anyways he, um, he had welded it on and then he welded on this bracket right about here so we can mount uh, the two, screw, two holes that go up there for mounting but uh, yeah that's a I, I like this plow a lot. It's good for what I do, and the, the uh, Minimo 2 uses the handle to put the pins in, and the old Minimo 1 is a lot different. That pin actually pulls out with a with a bar, pull it out, and then that's how you push it in. So it's it's a little little different setup, but uh, yeah, I painted it. Uh, I've had some few patches on it, but this plow don't owe me anything. It's got the sticker and everything. Painted it and painted the cut edge. It looks fairly good. I'm happy with the way that color came out, and that's that's that color is this color right here, um, the Cub Cadet Yellow. It's a lot cheaper per quart for that stuff than the Fisher Yellow. And I got another another quart right here, and then that's all I use for the paint, um, the black frame. I don't spray paint anymore because it gets overspray gets everywhere, and the painting with the brush, believe it or not. It, it goes pretty quick if you just get the cheapies. Like I, I'm not even going to use this one. I just took this out for the video. But I got some throwaway ones I got to go pick up. You could buy a 10 pack at Harbor Freight. Three inch 10, 10 pack or 12 pack or whatever it is for cheap money and just throw away the paintbrushes. Because this oil based enamel um, destroys paintbrushes. It, it's great. It's great when it's dry and everything. It's like, it's, I know you, obviously this video. You can't see what I'm seeing basically, but it just rained all morning and This stuff wears pretty well for the whole season as long as you're not plowing gravel and shit It, 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 does, it holds up pretty well It's just a leave. The wind is blowing pretty good today and some rainstorms come through Winter is on its way. There's no more leaves on the trees anymore really so, Winter's coming, but uh, Yeah, anyways just want to share this video with you about uh, just scraping and painting and just preserving your plows. Like this plow is probably a 1990, I don't know, I wonder if the serial number will tell anything, but I, I'm not sure how to read that. I'd have to look online to see if I can get those numbers to cross-reference cross uh, a year or something. But I know this is early, early 90 plow, you know. Uh, just because it's a minute mount one. It's a 7.6 um, for this year, so it's a standard duty. But um, like I said, I picked this plow up six years ago. I've used it a couple times, but I, I just can't see selling it. I bought it for $400. I try to see these things on Craigslist and on Facebook. Uh, trying to sell. You, can, I can get triple what I paid for this. Like I said, this pump alone right here is worth more than the plow, as far as I'm concerned. So. I'm gonna hold on to it and run that plow, which I always have the last couple seasons. Keep this one, and then uh, eventually I'll get a brand new setup, and that'll be my backup plow. And I'll end up selling this. There's no need to keep three fucking plows, but but I don't know. You never know. I might get another truck. See what happens. All right, guys. Like I said, if you're looking for a good alternative to Fisher Yellow and paying that price tag for that amount of money for that paint. Um, you can find this at, I bought this 
magic, majestic, whatever, truck, uh, tractor, um, oil-based enamel, and that's the serial number right there, 82944, Cub Cadet Yellow, it, it matches like perfectly, so, to the Fisher Yellow, pretty darn close anyways. Alright you guys, have a good weekend, have a good Thanksgiving, I'm doing this video right before Thanksgiving, so, see if I post another video later, but, uh, enjoy.